Yo, what's good, everybody? We got another beers with Barton, and it is Monday. Fun day, Monday? October 31st, 2022. It is All Hallows' Eve, Halloween evening. It is here. It's on a Monday night, which isn't ideal, but we're going to make it work. Uh, hopefully the rain has passed, which uh, just came through about an hour or so ago. kind of rained off and on all day, and then um, <clears throat> pretty big storm. About an hour ago, right? It's about 30 minutes or so. And now, looks like the sun's out. There's still a slight chance of rain around 637, but it looks like it's low. And then uh, pretty much 100% at um, about 11 o'clock. So it's about 5 o'clock here, Eastern Standard Time. We are going to get ready um, and head over to some friend's house. <clears throat> and uh, Michaela is going to get all dressed up. And the girls are going to go trick-or-treating. I'm around the neighborhood and hang out for a bit. So that's what we're getting ready to do. Um, I know Michaela's excited. So I'm going to be dressing up today as one of two things. I was either going to be a middle-aged um, Wells Fargo employee, um, just beaten with life, or uh, because the Niners won yesterday, I'll be going as a middle-aged 49ers fan. Uh, big win yesterday for them, 31-14. Um, it was 14-10 at halftime, a little slow, but uh, Christian McCaffrey, that trade looks good right now. Um, <clears throat> the uh, Only the fourth person in NFL history, only the third running back, and the first since 2005 to throw, catch, and run a touchdown. So he did great. Garoppolo looked good. He didn't have to do too much. Um, and uh, the Niners defense, even missing players, played great. Shut out the Rams in the second half. So Niners going at the half, or at the bye. Four and four, which looks a lot better than three and five. Still a game out of first behind Seattle Seahawks, who are supposed to be the one of, if not the worst team in the NFL. So crazier things have happened. But uh, <clears throat> we hang out yesterday at some friend's house, the same we're going to tonight. And uh, um, it was a birthday celebration for my buddy, um, who's a Rams fan. His birthday was on uh, Saturday, I believe, the 29th. Um, and then um, his sister-in-law, so his wife's sister, uh, actual birthday was yesterday. We're the same age except 20 days apart. Um, so we had fun. Uh, everyone was over there. Football kids uh, did some uh, parv parving, carving of pumpkins. Um, and uh, Michaela actually did a really cool one. She did a, uh, um, a raven. Uh, so we'll like that tonight. But, yeah, everyone had fun. Uh, Niners game made me very, very happy. So that's what we did. We're looking forward to tonight. And... Excuse me, Michaela doesn't have any homework tonight, which is pretty cool uh, since it is Halloween. So there you have it. Great weekend. Um, <clears throat> spent doing a lot of running around. Um, and a uh, good birthday celebration with a buddy I used to work with at Lowe's um, at uh, Resident Culture, one of my favorite, if not my favorite, brewer out here. They have a new location, South End, and it's like the tap house. They don't brew there, but um, <clears throat> it's like more of a, a, a cool party scene. They got a restaurant like right next to it. Uh, we got there about 7.30, and at 9 o'clock, a live DJ came on, which was cool. Music was great, but by 10 o'clock, place was packed. Uh, young kids and uh, young kids, they're probably in college, 25, 30, but they're young, um, <clears throat> started packing in there kind of changed the vibe so Jess and I headed out around 10 um Michaela was at a friend's house so and then Saturday we went to uh the head brewer and Mrs. Head Brewer's house they threw a fantastic Oktoberfest um amazing homemade food pierogies and and brats and sauerkraut and potato cakes it was phenomenal tons of beer flowed uh we hung out probably way too late didn't go home till after midnight and I think we got there about 4 45 5 um, and then all of us slept in until like 1045 on Sunday um, morning uh, before we headed over uh, to do the festivity. So great weekend, a little bit tired, got to play a little bit of catch up, uh, but got to watch a uh, football game tonight. Bengals and Browns because I've got a couple fantasy games that are uh, hinging on the uh, how this game goes down. So all right, that's what we're doing. So I thought it's appropriate. This is Pumpkin Pod. This is uh, Royal Bliss, uh, Denver. I know where my in-laws live. It's fantastic. Um, and it's, it's a 5-1. But I think it's going to drink like a 4.4. So that's the Niners record. Or a 4-9 because 49 is 1. Either way, eight regular season wins in a row against the Rams. Obviously didn't get the one that mattered, quote-unquote, uh, the NFC Championship game last year. But four years in a row. Uh, Sean McVay cannot beat uh, Kyle Shanahan. It makes me happy because I don't like the Rams at all. And I don't like Sean McVay. 
Uh, Matt Stafford's cool. I'm glad he got a ring last year. Or I'm not glad he got a ring, but I'm okay with him getting a ring because I like that guy a lot. And he was in Detroit for years. So, anyways, cheers. Glad we uh, dominated them 24 to 9 um, in week four and uh, 31 to 14 in week eight. So, it's fantastic. We get a bye week. Hopefully, get some guys back. Debo was out yesterday. Some of those defensive guys, Armstead and Kinlaw and Greenlaw. And, uh, yeah. Looking forward to seeing what the rest of the season holds as long as we stay healthy and CMC plays anywhere like he did yesterday. So, all right, cheers. Happy Halloween to all. Pumpkin pie. It's an autumn ale. It's delicious. Cheers. Oh, it's delicious. And so Michaela is actually going as... A hippie this year, uh, which pretty much means she's dressing like Jess dresses now, I guess. I don't know. Um, she's got cool flare pants and like a tie-dye shirt. She's got uh, um, big hoop earrings. Uh, she has these like big um, fake glasses, um, like flowery glasses that are pink, I think. And then she's got like this cool flowy hairband thing. So <clears throat> she's wearing some white kicks. So pretty creative, pretty cheap costume. Um, and, uh, you know, we're out of the princess stage now, so it's, uh, doing things like this. I don't even remember what she was last year. I can't even remember. I don't know what I had for breakfast, so that's not, uh, surprising, but cheers again to Halloween. Cheers to the Niners. Got to make it about the Niners. If they'd have lost, it wouldn't be much of a cheer. So, all right, everybody, have a great Halloween. Have a safe Halloween. Hope the kids are looking forward to it and having fun. Um, I know this is a cool holiday, and then, bam, it's November. We're a couple weeks from Thanksgiving, and then, bam, we're a couple weeks from Christmas, and then it's New Year's. It's 2023, so this year's flying by. <clears throat> Cheers. All right. Happy All Hallows' Eve. Until next time, go Niners. Deuces.